practices start, the new LCU head football coach Ben McLaughlin and his staff are preparing for the upcoming season by hosting a prospect camp. I had the opportunity to attend the camp and get to hear more about the changes coming to the LCU football program. Although coach Ben McLaughlin is the new head football coach at Louisiana Christian University, he is no stranger to the school or the Sinla area. Looking forward to coming back home. This is the place that made me. I know this place. I've seen every corner of this from a freshman to a GA to a coordinator now as a head coach. So hopefully we can, I can continue to help build this place. McLaughlin is inheriting a team from the former player and head coach Drew Maddox, who brought the Wildcats to a 9-2 record and a conference championship last season. Look, what I've told him is, like, me and Coach Maddox, when you look at us, you probably couldn't find two different looking individuals. But at the end of the day, we're cut from the same cloth. He's an LC guy. I'm an LC guy. We were raised in this. So yes, we may be from the opposite ends of that cloth, but we're from the same cloth. So we, every, everything that they did, we are going to continue. There's not a lot of change. This is a continuation. It's my flavor of it, but it's all the same stuff. And so it's uh, just telling them to take everything they've done and we're going to build upon it and to trust me and trust that we're going to go in the right direction. And so far they have. Despite the changes in the program, the players are confident in McLaughlin and are excited to get on the field to start learning the new playbook. Everybody's kind of bought in at this point. You know, weight room is a little different. Offense is different, but it's still the same LCU. It's still the same standard. You know, as far as that, nothing's changed. It's still the same culture. Hey, everybody's ready to go. You know, it's been too long, you know, whole month of June, whole month of May. I think if you love football, everyone's ready to get back to it, get back to work. McLaughlin and his team host multiple football camps, giving back to the Sinla community while looking for potential new prospects. We want to try to go back more old school. This is a camp to actually to try to help kids make them better football players, not just run a 40, see their times. That's all good stuff. But this was truly a skills camp where we were teaching two hours of nothing but football and fundamentals. Let them know the standard, you know, coming in, all those guys. You know, came through, came from different high schools, different states. They all did things a different way. It's just about getting them bought in and, and having them, you know, build into what we do and just teaching them the way. You know, it doesn't matter. If you buy in, you'll win. At today's skill camp, many local Sinla athletes attended, giving them the opportunity to show off their skills in front of a collegiate program. It's just like a different feel. Sometimes I go to the big school camps. It really, you don't get that much exposure, competition. They just know who they want, but to these camps like this, they everybody can get a rep and just having fun. It's, it's awesome because stuff that we learning, it's also stuff that you can like add to your bag, like your craft, you know, you know when to use it, you can read defenses, see the plays, run it through your head and everything. I feel like we have a great chance to bring something to the table, something that he need, and I think he uh, has the confidence in us and we have the confidence in ourselves that we could be the people, the guys that he need for the next season. At Louisiana Christian University for Five Sports, yes. I'm Julia Keller.